Holden, what are some of the scheme changes, differences, similarities with what you had at Notre Dame and what you're working with now at Tennessee on offense? Yeah, um, I would say some big differences for sure um, come from Notre Dame. A lot of 12 personnel, um, a lot of huddling, slower pace offense for sure. Run the ball a lot. Um, Tennessee, you know, we run the ball a lot as well. But just a different scheme for sure. Um, coming to Tennessee, obviously, tempo offense, uh, playing in space a lot more, wide splits. Um, so I've been adapting well, just trying to put my head down, work, figure everything out, taking what I learned from the meeting room with Coach Ablin um, to the field and transitioning that way. But so far, it's been pretty good, you know, ups and downs, but that's expected, you know, with the transition. But I think I've been handling it well so far. How far along in the transition do you think you are and what's, what's been the hardest part about it and, and how comfortable do you feel with it as you close out spring here? Um, I would say, you know, I'm progressing well. I would just say each day I've tried to improve on something. So whether it be, you know, lining up faster, uh, processing the signals faster, you know, knowing my read immediately just with the ball getting snapped so quick um, from the previous question, like for, coming from Notre Dame, we would huddle. You would have time to diagnose the defense before the ball's getting snapped here, getting the signal, plays getting, you know, happening immediately. So just those transitions. But overall, I think I'm progressing well. Um, through the end of spring ball, I just want to keep my head down, keep trying to get better day in and day out, and um, you know, not looking too far ahead. And uh, just using the last few practices, you know, finish the right way going into the uh, summer and whatnot, but just feeling comfortable overall. Sometimes teams will say they, they emphasize the tight end, and then when it comes to the season, you don't really see it. How much like research did you do of Josh Hop and how much he does emphasize the tight ends? Yeah, uh, I did a lot of research. Um, Coach Hype, Coach Halsley, Coach A's were a big part of my decision and just showcasing the tight end and what they do for this offense. I think a big piece in their recruitment to me was just having a guy that, you know, can eat up space with the, you know, the splits that we play in and getting in those windows, getting the ball in my hands, and then just using all that grass, you know, make plays. Um, I think that was something that was really intriguing to me and one of the reasons that led to me coming here. So, like I've been talking about, just getting comfortable in the offense and, you know, finding my, finding my rhythm through it and then just, you know, going to making plays when the fall comes. Holden, how do you envision your, your role coming together in, in the fall? Um, come fall, um, I kind of just want to be that overall tight end that can, you know, get you know, busy in the run game, you know, open up holes for the running backs, and then you know, play out in space, block for the receivers out in space. That's a big thing, um, big adjustment that I've been you know, trying to get better at as well. And then obviously trying to get the ball in my hands and just being a downfield playmaker for this team, um, being a big red zone threat. That's a big emphasis as well in terms of highlighting the tight ends, you know, getting them the ball in the red zone. So just kind of trying to be an all-around threat at tight end, blocking game, um, passing game, trying to do it all for the offense. What have been your early impressions in chemistry with Nico? Uh, early impressions is he's got a great arm, great leader, great young leader, um, knows what to say, knows how to bring the guys together. His uh, performance speaks for itself. And uh, right now, just trying to build the chemistry with him going, you know, through the end of spring. But so far, it's been great just, you know, developing the timing with him. Ball is always going to be on the money. So just trying to prove to him that I can be a guy that can count on when, you know, he throws the ball to make a play for the team. Well, what are your, your impressions of a couple of your other your teammates at tight end, Ethan, and then uh, Miles, another older guy transfer that came in? What are your, what are your thoughts on those two guys? Yeah, um, it's been a great, um, you know, room so far. Just, you know, we're all trying to build off each other make each other better. Um, you know, Ethan's obviously the younger of us three that you mentioned, but, you know, he's a very athletic tight end, really good player, obviously. Um, and then he's been here in the offense. So sometimes just trying to pick his brain, what made the transition hard from him, just coming from high school into college um, and just seeing, you know, stuff that I can learn from him. And then Miles, obviously, coming from Bama, another great player, um, coming from a program like Alabama. He's been well coached. He knows what to do when he goes out there. Um, so just learn from him. You know, we're all picking each other's brains. Hey, what do you see on that play? Um, and just trying to implement it into our game and just make each other better all around.